Hi there, I'm Andrea from ACDC, and welcome to the ACDC Ancestry series. In this series, we will follow a boy and his dog as they go from dull, forgotten film negative to lively, full-color photo using ACDC Photo Studio Ultimate 2020. In this video, part three of the series, we will take a black and white photograph and bring it to life by adding color. To learn how we got to this point, check out part one, how to develop a negative, and part two, how to restore an old photo. You can find the links to these in the description of this video. First, I'll open my black and white photograph in edit mode. I'm basically going to treat the photo like a coloring book, and each layer that I add will represent a different colored marker. Add a blank layer by clicking the plus sign. Then add a mask to that layer. Now set the mask to black by right-clicking on the mask and selecting Set Mask Black. Change the blend mode of this layer to Soft Light. This will allow the detail of the photo to show through the color. I'll start by coloring in the boy's face, so now I need to select a color for his skin. To set my foreground color, I'll make sure the layer is selected, not the mask, and click on the foreground square. When choosing your colors, you want to select something a bit darker than the desired result, because the soft light blend mode will soften the color. Now I'll use the fill bucket to fill in this layer. You can see that the color is applied to the layer, but nothing shows up on the image. That's because our mask is set to black, and therefore hiding the layer. If I set the mask to white, you can see it shows through on the entire image. That's not what we want though, so I'll switch it back to black, make sure it's selected, and make sure my foreground color is white and background color is black by clicking on the little black and white squares, then inverting them using the arrow. Select the brush tool. Now I'm ready to color in the boy's face. So I'll zoom in, and you can see that everywhere I apply the brush, the color layer shows through. If I accidentally color outside the lines and want to erase my brush stroke, I can just right click over it. This applies the background color black to the mask, and therefore hides the layer where applied. Now since we will be doing this for each color in the image, I'm going to stay organized and rename my layer. To rename a layer, right click on the layer and select Rename Layer. Type in the layer name and click OK. To save a bit of time in my workflow, I'll also create an action for adding a new color layer. To record an action, click Record New Action. Now it will record my steps. Add blank layer, Add mask, set mask to black, change the blend mode to soft light. Click stop recording. Name your action and select a category for it. Now when I want to add a new color layer, I can just use the drop down arrow beside play action and navigate to my add color layer action. Now I'll just time lapse through this coloring process. I recommend saving your file periodically throughout the editing process so you can take a break if needed and not lose any work. Feel free to change the colors on any of the layers if they don't quite look right. Just select the layer you wish to change, click on your foreground color square, select a new color, and fill in the layer with the fill bucket. You'll notice I can also color right over parts of the image that have snow on them without turning the snow completely brown. Now 
Another trick for blending in the added color is to soften the edges of the mask by feathering it. To do that, just make sure the mask is selected and use the slider under Mask Properties to increase the feathering. Okay, the photo looks like it's almost done. To make it more realistic though, I'll add some blush to the boy's cheeks. looking a bit harsh, so I'll fix that by feathering the mask. And lowering the opacity of the layer. And we are done. Let's compare the before and after. Thanks for following along, and don't forget to check out the other videos in the ACDC Ancestry series. Thank <laughs> you.